What's up guys, ZachTag12 here and welcome back to Skyward Sword HD. Today we are going to be doing the Temple of Time and areas around it. Um, and entering the Linnaeu Mining Facility, but unfortunately my right Joy-Con has died, so unfortunately I am forced to use button controls. It's a fate worse than death, really. Oh my god, where do I go? Oh, a time... Time stone. I don't know why I was trying to use motion controls. And a few... Okay, a few... Okay, Quadrababa. Ah! Oh, whoa! Oh! <laughs> yeah! Okay, so this is much easier to do with, um, just clicking in the right stick, but I don't understand how it's able to cut grass. So I'm gonna kill this bow coblin, and he falls. And there we go, we got a dragonfly. A Gerudo dragonfly, which doesn't make any sense as the Gerudo don't exist yet. Okay. At least I got an ancient flower. Oh, that's on the other side, I actually, oh yeah. I have to get in this. How do they know to stop outside of the time bubble? That makes no goddamn sense. I cannot wait till I get the speed ability. So up here there is a giant time shift stone. Okay. I don't know why I thought- okay, there's a goddess cube over there. That's one of the goddess cubes we need to get. Okay, I don't know why I'm trying to pilot this with motion controls. Even though this would work perfectly fine with the motion controls that are inside the pro controller. It's not like the pro controller doesn't have any motion controls. Big time shift stone. And now it's a beautiful tree. Now let's get in the minecart. Let's get out, get out, get out. No, no, great. Slingshot. Let's get in. Perfect. That opens that door up. Now we can get to the other side. I don't know why I, I'm now instinctively using the right stick for camera control, even though that doesn't work because, well, I can't just use it for camera control. And now I need to find a way to go to the Lanayru mining facility. There we go, kill the Octorok. Um. Okay, back up. And then. And there we go. Ow. Perfect. So another Goron. Okay, he just tells us some stuff. Uh, time shift stone. Okay, ancient flower. I wonder how these time shift stones work. Oh wow, I actually need to. I can't just like push it because there's a droid there. And I need to find a way to get him to move so that when he eventually dies. 
That's just, uh, rupees. Okay. Grab a bomb. Good thing the, the range on it is, is fucking huge. Time shift stone. Alright, bonk into it. I don't know why I'm being quiet. I really shouldn't be quiet. I... And there's, there's a Boko. Ow. Ow. Okay. Okay. Okay, seriously, I hate these- Oh my god, I'm gonna die. Good thing I got a fairy. go fatal blow heart okay now you can move oh and he's gonna update my map there we go now it shows the way it used to look I, I really wish that I could just have a giant time zone time stone that just that just opens up everything to be pristine and everything. I, I couldn't think of the word. I don't want to be in a desert. I want to be in a grassy area. So I guess I'm going to ride this. I bet he's wondering why it stopped when it hadn't hit anything, because... Do these droids understand the, how the time shift stones work? Do the, I mean, one of them later implies as much, but it doesn't really say directly. Jump out. Jump out. I, I, oh, oh wait, actually I have to skyward strike it while I'm in there. Skyward strike. There we go, that's a goddess cube. So now we're gonna at least get to the entrance of the Lineru Mines. We're gonna get inside and we're gonna ride it. Yeah. It's real fun just using, using L, using ZL to just correct my camera. There we go. Perfect. Um, let me add a shortcut. All right. Okay. Oh, this just allows me to go back whenever I want. This doesn't necessarily allow me to... to do anything. Um... Maybe I really shouldn't go back. I mean, there's a Bokoblin. I mean, it's the only way I'm gonna be able to fight that Bokoblin, but... why would I want to fight a Bokoblin? I've only been fighting the Octoroks because they tend to be annoying. So now I'm on the other side of the desert. Okay, Amber Treasure. Okay, Fee. So yes, I understand how that works, and you're giving me five waypoints. I'm not gonna deal with these stupid pelicans. So I need to enter the linear mining facility. That's 
I just realized Link's face doesn't even change. He's like, I still have the same blank expression. I am husk. <laughs> That's what Link looks like to me. Okay, I can stand. Don't you dare drop it. Don't you dare drop it. Don't. You missed. These things need to be activated. There's a bird statue over here. North Desert. And I think I know how to enter. I just don't know if there's another goddess cube that I can get, but I think that there is. There's a heart piece. So I gotta be on the lookout for a heart piece. Um, I guess I just need to ignore that goddess cube at the moment. And there's a few generators that I need to get to. Um, get over to this area. Wait, why? I don't understand. Usually where the grass is, that's where the goodies are. I can't run up it. Um, I can't go over there yet. Okay, so bomb. Nah, I'm not gonna pull out bombs. I'm just gonna use bomb flowers. Oh wow, it automatically pulls out bombs. Nice. Using bomb flowers automatically pulls out bombs. I'm gonna blow up this wall. And there's a heart piece that I gotta be on the lookout for. So this allows me to enter an area. And right now it is in the present. But I wanna make it the past. Oh, it's Zed Arthro. Come on. Come on, blow up, blow up. That kills it. And a heart, nice. Okay. Maybe I should run over this way. Okay. I can't do anything when my stamina is depleted, unlike Breath of the Wild, where I can do stuff when my stamina is depleted. Like, Breath of the Wild system is just better. Because it's... I, I would not really want to say because it's Breath of the Wild, because Breath of the Wild does have its own flaws that I do acknowledge, unlike a lot of other people. Because, like, a lot of people don't really acknowledge Breath of the Wild's flaws. So throw it over there. Maybe maybe I'm not okay, so maybe I'm not rolling. And there's a time shift stone. Now I can uh, swing at it. Alright, now the whole room and the sand disappears and they become these little things. Okay, now I can dig here for some hearts. Okay, I'm just gonna wait till they swing. Yeah, I think it's just gonna be smart to wait till they swing. Because then they can't defend. At least I got some red rupees. Ow! Okay, swing. Okay, never mind. Alright. Perfect. Okay. 
Okay, another chest. Please have some rupees, because I really need rupees. I mean, at least it's better than nothing. Ow! Okay, not. And he's dead. So I'm gonna pick this thing up. Okay, and it shocks me. Okay, this thing is going to shock me a lot. There we go, that powers it up. That allows me to enter this room, which I think has like a power generator or something that we need to activate. Perfect. That activates the lightning power generator. So I guess because it appeared in the past, it appears in the present. That's been activated. Okay, at least they're using droids to mine instead of slave labor like Elon Musk does. Yeah, I just gotta, gotta, gotta say that. Um, my anti-capitalist viewpoints. Now let's leave and go back out into the desert. All right. I have no clue where else the other ones. Would okay, I think I have a clue. Actually, I, I don't know. I think I have a clue. Um. No, I think this actually what I need. I need I need to come back when I have the claw shots. Which I do come back here to get the claw shots eventually. Phew, sorry, I had to sneeze. No. Pick up bomb. Okay. Run over here. Throw it in. And I think there's like a time shift stone or something in here. Just an amber relic. Just run. And I'm just gonna store some bombs. Because I need more bombs. I could always use more bombs. Like, because uh, I guess. Bomb flowers, um, in other Zelda games, bomb flowers were just there to, um, have explosive when you don't have bombs yet. But now they're basically one and the same with bombs. And now, um, powder kegs and remote bombs exist in Breath of the Wild. Okay, blow it up. There's a couple bokos, uh, dead bokos here. And there's a time shift stone. All right. Comes day. I mean, I, I don't know why I said it becomes day. Okay, why did I do that? That was stupid. Okay, fatal blow. Okay, dead, ancient flower. And I don't know where another one would be. Maybe it's gonna put me back up there because that technically isn't solid ground. Yeah, it's gonna put me back up there. Nice. Um, I could sit, but I don't feel like sitting. And I love how it just disappears because it wasn't there in the past. So let's uh, get the hook beetle out. I grab this. And I'm gonna fly up and kill you. 
Kill the bird. Kill the big bird. Ow! Double ow! Just a double ow. I really wish I can. I cannot wait till I get the speed upgrade for the beetle. I cannot wait till that happens. Because that's going to be fun. Okay, at least I killed it. All right, nice. Okay, run up. Okay, let's actually just jump down here. Because there's some stuff that we can get over here. Oh, okay. There's like two blue rupees and a green rupee and I really want them. I... Fuck. Just plain fuck. Just the plain, unadulterated fuck. <sighs> fucking piece of shit. Fucking piece of motherfucking piece of shit. Fuck. God damn it. Okay. I got a bomb. I'm gonna drop it in. I unfortunately cannot use, um, okay, there's an amber relic. Ow, I did it again. I, I hit the control stick. It's a good thing it's not motion controls, because, because, I mean, this would definitely be more, a bit more difficult to do with motion controls, but I prefer to do it this way. The sun. Okay. Okay, let's recharge my stamina. Let's just run over here. Amber Relic. Okay, why am I trying to press minus to change my items? Oh wow, that actually worked. Well, at least that's gonna blow up the time shift stone. Ooh, 20 rupees, 20 rupees, 20 rupees, 20 rupees, 20 rupees, 20 rupees. At least I'm now standing on solid ground. That's perfect. Just like the Elden Volcano one, it's a lot more difficult to uh, get inside the dungeon. We're not gonna enter the dungeon today, we're just gonna open it up. Perfect. We got the water. Okay, I figured out how to get to the other side, thankfully. I, I was just an idiot. I used the sky to warp over here instead of going the long way around. Which I feel like is just smarter to do. There's an amber relic up there, but I'm not gonna get it. So I'm just gonna go over here and unlock- Okay, so there's this, and I can finally open up this so I don't have to take the stupid long way around again. Just grab on that. That opens up. Surprise that's still in pristine condition. Stone cache. And open this up. Let's head inside. And this is where the third power generator is. Or the terminal, or something. It's fucking something. I don't know. And it's similar to the other one that we went through. Fuck me. Just fuck me. Just, just r absolutely destroy my virgin asshole. Yes, I'm 100% serious. Give me that shoe jelly. Ooh, bombs. Ten bombs. That's really good. So I can dig in this spot. 
Okay, let's throw some bombs. Come on, please be a time shift stone, because I need a time shift stone, because I need to be able to get places. Okay. Okay, oh, you no. Know. Wow. I'm wanting to test something. Wait, can I actually get it from this area? No. Now this whole area. Now there's Bokos. That I need to fight. Chest. Blue Rupee. Okay. Okay, no. No. Thank you for the heart. I thankfully have a fairy. There we go. Another heart. Oh no. Perfect, he's dead. Give me the heart. Okay, another dead one. Fatal blow. He didn't drop a heart. Even though I could really use that. Please be like... Uh, I was hoping it was 20 rupees. It's only 5. Let's hop up. That doesn't allow me anywhere. Okay, this allows me to dig for some rupees. 15. Not too bad of an amount. It's not that bad. It's, it's actually a pretty good amount. Pretty good amount of rupees. What's over here? Okay, what 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 happens if I blow that up? Do I get some five rupees? Oh wow, that's actually just a green rupee. I thought it was a blue rupee. Maybe it's just well, the way my screen is. For a sec, I thought it was a blue rupee. Give me hearts. Okay, bombs. Uh huh. Huh. So I need to get up there. And what I need to do is... Throw a bomb. Alright. Okay, that is gonna be a pain in the ass. Get closer to the wall. So now I can ride it. I can ride the sand. So that is my strat, to ride the sand. Deku seeds. Let's hop up here. It's a yellow choo-choo. And let's open this up. And now, I can push that over and get over from the other side. Okay, so Elden Ore. Just push this over. Oh wait, what am I doing? 
just run. Uh, okay. No, I can't swipe my sword. I can't swipe my sword because my stamina is out. So I'm gonna pick you up. Ow! These things do a lot of damage. Okay, seriously, these things do a lot of damage. How do I get it over there? Um... Huh. That blows that up. Reveals nothing. It's not like I can hook shot or claw shot to grab it. Oh, the beetle! I just realized the beetle! I'm an idiot! Now I'm smart! Let's grab the beetle. Okay, let's move. Okay, turn. Let's move it as far as I can with the beetle. Okay. Okay. Perfect. Moved it all the way over there. There we go, now it's in there. And now it's gonna get sucked up. It's gonna get siphoned. Ooh, a chest. A couple chests, actually. It's probably just gonna be like a goddess plume or something rather than rupees, which I really need. It's a monster horn, actually. Nice. Something new. Five rupees. Alright. And that's the fire terminal. Now that that's activated, I can... Alright. So now we just gotta make our way to the main area. And we gotta make our way to the entrance, which I'm going to open up. Which I'm just gonna get to the bird statue and open it up in the next episode. Because I have some editing to do to cut this video down from the length that it is. Alright. Shut the fuck up, Fee. I don't care. Okay, you know what I'm gonna do? I'm gonna- wait a minute, I can actually just go the way around, right? Yeah, I can just go the way around. I- I don't have to- oh wait, what happened to my shield? Oh, I unequip my shield. Good thing I have a fairy! Yeah, good thing I got a fairy. Okay. Wait for stamina to recharge. And then I'm gonna pop up on here. Run across. Recharge stamina. And run across here. This gives me a heart, right? Yes, it gives me a heart. Yummy heart. Now I'm gonna go save. And... Alright, here's the bird statue. Let's save, and I'll see you guys next time. Peace.